We continue our month-long series, Autism Life on the Spectrum. Tonight, we're talking about getting a diagnosis. And it is a frightening, trying, and confusing time for parents. Fox 5's Linda Schmidt with one family's journey. Joe Murray spends his whole fucking day talking about Phil. <laughs> oh my dude bro dude nah fuck this i need to go get high real quick <coughs> oh my god yeah no i needed to take a dab dude i need to strengthen jesus christ to make it through this video ah so yesterday, or the day before, however you want to look at it, whenever I get this shitty video out, Phil's on Twitter on his day off, saying, hey, I got a surprise for you guys, nerd. Get hyped! <laughs> <laughs> and immediately, literally immediately, all of us knew it was a bubble blower. Like a bubble gun or a bubble machine. We knew it involved the bubbles, bro. You know, it's one of those things that's been a coming. So, lo and behold, this stupid little adult has a bubble machine. <laughs> not, only, not, only, not only does the retard avoid, he has two, two bubble guns. Oh my god, it just, dude, the level one podcast... And Phil's whole shtick is a whole. It gets more and more just like stupid by the day. <laughs> oh my lord, let's get into it. It's hilarious, man. Holy shit. This is a 41 year old man, guys. Uh, man. Like, seriously, I got so much positive stuff to talk about. I do. And you know what? The cool thing all about that is, is that I had a nice day off yesterday. I isolated myself from the internet. I paid attention to absolutely nothing, pretty much. I just spent a day with my wife, and we had a lot to do yesterday. And I had a nice, relaxing day. And I got all these new stories together, and I come on the stream, and of course, people immediately start referencing, oh, drama, this, drama, that. And I'm like, I know nothing about this drama, which is great. I unplugged myself from bullshit for several days, and I was not aware of any of this stuff. And I come back and I see people talking about drama in the channel. Like, I'm so glad that I'm not involved in this crap, you know? I really am happy that now we're going to have a nice week. There's tons of stuff to do. I'm going to be super busy here on the streams with all of you. Don't have to worry about any of that outside nonsense. Okay, this is excellent. That motherfucker's lying, bro. Literally. He knows about everything going on. The Wings Boogie fight, bro. All the trash talking we're doing about OIC, how we just know how predictable he is, you know? We know all his plans before he really spins them all the way into action, bro. It bothers Phil, okay? Phil's really bothered by side scrollers and Rich and Keem, and Keem starts talking to Phil's family, you know? Like, think about it. Phil's a perpetually online 41-year-old man-child, bro. The guy is never offline, you know? So for him to say that, I unplugged for the internet? Sure. Yeah, I bet he needed to. Think about it. Phil needed to unplug, bro. He probably would have flipped this shit off rip on the Level 1 podcast, fool. So ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce something to the stream, something new. Alright, it arrived yesterday, and I'm excited to introduce it, alright? 
This is someone else's idea. I'm not gonna lie. Someone else came up with this idea. It was not mine. All right. Yeah, it was our idea. Literally, he stole the idea from our community, which confirms. Like, you heard all of us tell this fucker to just get a bubble machine at one point or another. So, no, I'm a, we need to get our tulips and roses. I can, uh, I can debut it now. And it will be something interesting and fun for the streams. All right. We'll definitely add something. And, uh... I wonder what it could be. What the, ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh my god! Holy shit! That's a lot! Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you a bubble gun. You gonna make me kill myself. I'm gonna kill my- <sighs> That was pretty awesome, and that was like half a second of holding it down. The, the bubble gun is amazing, alright? It is absolutely amazing. However, there's a catch to it. This thing uses a lot of bubble juice. That's the bubble juice it came with, and it uses a lot of bubble juice. So, if I even like- Bro! Last year, for my son's fourth birthday, I got him the exact same bubble gun. And my son would run around the house going, <laughs> Dad, look at the bubbles. And then I'm sitting here looking at this 41-year-old man, bro. Holding this bubble gun, bro. Looking at all the bubbles in autistic excitement, bro. It, it's enough to make you want to jump out of a building. Someone kill me. This is legitly the most retarded level one podcast ever. <laughs> he looks like a little autistic boy showing off his new little bubble guns, bro. What the fuck, dog? This is a 41-year-old man. I can't believe this shit. For more than half a second, this thing starts shooting out like dozens and dozens of bubbles all over the place. And it was funny because I, I tried it yesterday for the first time. And Kat says, wow, that's really good, but be careful because you're in a room with a bunch of electronics. And if you go crazy, right, you might end up like soaking all your electronics in bubbles. And, you know, and also, you know, it gets everywhere. You gotta be careful. And I was like, oh, okay. And it was actually funny because yesterday I'm talking with my moderator team, okay? Wait, hold on, bro. I hope y'all caught that shit again. Let's play that shit real quick. Hold on. I want to make sure I didn't, I'm not insane or going bad of hearing. Because yesterday I'm talking with my moderator team. Talk with my moderator team. Okay. Yesterday I'm talking with my moderator team. Okay. And I told him, hey guys, guess what? I got something new for the streams tomorrow. Holy shit, he really did say that. He like, he's just confirmed again that he has a secret little discord or a secret little safe space where he sits there and talks with all the dickheads behind the scenes, dude. Holy shit. He can't even keep his lies together. He literally said the other day he never uses Discord and shit. My fucking God, Phil. Stop lying. <laughs> it's like we already knew you had... Like, bro, talking to him on his day off. You know, we, were, we already figured that when our channels were getting struck and shit, dude, that he was doing it on his day off. Like, he was coordinating them around his day off, dog. This is stupid. Holy shit, Phil. You need to learn how to keep your mouth shut, bro. <laughs> like, no, dude, now it's just super confirmed in my head that you be doing little sneaky sneak games behind the scenes, coordinating tips, uh, asking for ideas, all kinds of wild shit, bro. Holy crap. No, Phil, is this a setup? I was like, what are you talking about? They go... Oh, did someone send you a gun that looks like a handgun so you put it on stream and everyone will look and think that you have a gun on stream and try to get you banned from YouTube? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, this is an authentic Glock and uh, I'm got, now I'm going to be banned from YouTube because this is such a dangerous weapon, alright? You can't send your kids to my streams because I'm weaving firearms. <laughs> okay, alien blaster, doesn't it? It kind of looks like the alien blaster from like Fallout. But just to show you how crazy good this is, watch this, ready? 
That's a lot of bubbles, dude. And it's the cool thing, they're small, but they shine nicely. Like they're really good quality bubbles, right? Really high quality bubbles? What the hell, Phil? What does that mean, bro? <laughs> high quality bubbles, bro. Like, what the fuck? Is the soap from the moon or some shit, bro? These are really high quality bubbles, nerd. Oh my god. This guy. He is so far gone. <laughs> Holy shit. This is the best episode of autistic 41 year old man's life ever, dude. Bubble goal on the stream. I'm going to use the bubble gun. All right, that's how we're gonna do it from now on. Now, of course, the question is, do we really wanna do full screen? Because this is how I used to do it. I used to do this, but now it's like too up close and now you can't really see the bubbles. I think you might want me to actually be going full screen or, or on webcam, Let's just stay the widescreen webcam. So when I shoot them, you can see them all on camera because now they're going everywhere, all right? But ladies and gentlemen, you see around here on DSP Gaming, when we have a new edition, we just don't do it normal you know a lot of people they would say wow that's great it's a new addition it's very exciting to the streams this is cool but you see ladies and gentlemen here on dsp gaming that's that's just not one step one step isn't too far we got to go the whole monty in ladies and gentlemen i present to you the dual wheeled bubble guns yes the, it's not fire oh here we go the dual wheel bubble guns that's what i'm talking about here on dsp gaming baby yeah yeah What's better than a beggar with one bubble gun? A fucking clown ass beggar with two bubble guns. Oh my god. Wow, oh my, I'm soaked. Dude, there's bubbles everywhere. <laughs> it went absolutely everywhere on my setup. That's right, I'm a Kimbo Bubble, baby, yeah! Woo! All right. I dare you to say I'm still on level one now. But anyway. Bro, Phil. Okay, I'll give it to you, Phil. You're not on level one, bro. You legitly rage quit the fucking game. You're like a crackhead under a fucking bridge at this point, dog. Nobody can help you. Nobody can save this shit, dog. Not even Keemstar. Get out of here. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I can't believe he said that. Which is what I was, honestly, that's what I was afraid of. It was with bubble guns like this. Is that the bubbles are gonna go everywhere, explode, and make a big bubbly, soapy mess. And indeed they have. All right. Anyway, put those back into the holster. Let me get tissue here to clean up. You know what I mean? You know what? You would almost want to give Phil kind of props if he did this a long time ago. All of us attractors have been telling him to get a little bubble gun or a bubble machine for months, dude. And guess what? Boogie got one before him just to make fun of his ass. So... You know, that shows you how, like, just far gone and unhelpable Phil is, dude. And how retarded he looks doing this shit every day, dude. Every day, the guy gets worse. This is awesome. We're in for a little slow, boring, but kind of funny ride. I'm not gonna lie. Phil looked like a little stupid kid with those stupid little guns, man. Utterly pathetic. All right, I'm gonna get out of here, guys. I have better shit to do, man. I have work in the morning. But yo, tomorrow, Bacon Social Club, we're gonna play the Street Fighter VI beta if everything goes my way. Please, please, I hope I'm able to like get in there and play it, dude. And then hopefully I'm able to give away one copy of Street Fighter VI to one lucky person on uh, Steam. So remember to add me on Steam so I could go on your wish list when we do the giveaway tomorrow night. Till then, take care of yourselves and each other. Don't work too hard. And remember, remember, feels a little baggy bitch. All right, my friends. I'll see you later. Peace. But those people who make that shit up should be sued. They should be sued into oblivion. But I'm not a rich man, and I don't have the means to do it. You know, some of that stuff out there has been insanely damaging and messed up the things they said about me and my family. That's completely false. And they have absolutely no factual corroboration for any of it.
I'm a dunce. I'm a dunce. Yes, that's true. He's a pedophile. He's a racist. He's a sexist. Yes, that's true. I smell. I'm a dunce. Offensive. Egregious Ross dresser. Yes, that's true. Gifted a body that has a lot of shortcomings, okay? Bad back injury. A severely herniated gout. You oozing with grit. Post nasal gout. Gout is a disease that makes act like an ass. He's a racist. He's a sexist. He's a scammer. He's this. He's that. Yes, that's true. I'm a dunce. I'm a dunce. Yes, that's true. He's a pedophile. He's a racist. He's a sexist. Yes, that's true. I smell. I'm a dunce. Stupid mouth drooler. Offensive. Egregious Ross dresser. Yes, that's true. I'm a dunce. I'm a dunce. Yes, that's true. He's a pedophile. He's a racist. He's a sexist. Yes, that's true. I smell. I'm a dunce. Offensive. 